Finally tonight, a program that's a welcome relief for children who are battling serious illnesses. It's giving them the gift of music and in the process, putting a lot of smiles on their faces. NBC's Mark Potter has tonight's Making a Difference report. In the jungle, the mighty jungle. Young voices and a joyful sound in a place where happiness can sometimes be hard to find. These children are in music therapy at the Jackson Pediatric Center in Miami, all playing instruments donated by lifelong musician Corey Bergman, who heads the Ukulele Kids Club. It's a fun club. It's not a sad club. We're not curing any diseases. We're just making everybody feel good. To help heal himself after his son died from a viral disease, Bergman began playing guitar at children's hospitals, but soon realized a small ukulele is a better fit for kids stuck in bed. You can't help but smile or laugh when you hear this instrument. With help from donations, Bergman and his wife Etta have given 500 ukuleles to kids and teens for music therapy in more than 85 hospitals around the country. That's kind of cool. I've never had like an instrument like that, so it's cool. Stephanie Epstein, a music therapist at Holtz Children's Hospital, loves the ukuleles and music's proven ability to make kids smile. They become children again. They're not a patient in a hospital. They're not a patient with cancer. Eight-year-old Isabella Perez Donate is so good with her ukulele now that she can teach others to play her favorite Selena Gomez song. Goes A minor, okay. C, F, C. A minor, C, F, C. Okay, let's do it. And split it down a chain reaction. And here I go, here I go, here I go, go. And just like that, the hospital melts away for a moment of joy and magic for her and her friends in the Ukulele Kids Club. Mark Potter, NBC News, Miami.